Senna challenging for that second place, and he's taken it. A magnificent bit of driving by Senna, who's now in second place. That was absolutely marvellous. Senna went round the outside of Lauda, and that was uh, brave and skillful. Out goes the chequered flag, and Senna has won, and you can see that this usually totally unflappable, imperturbable Brazilian is for once absolutely beside himself with, look at him, both hands waving. And Mansell, if he gets it right, can sprint out of the rear wing of Senna's car. Senna moves across, he's keeping Mansell back, and he wins. Mansell won't like that. Senna gets away, of course, fantastic. Senna left on the grid. Right almost onto the grass. Tremendous stuff there from Senna, so he really is charging, and this should be quite something to watch. Senna is getting close to him, and Senna is going to challenge for the lead. Yes, and Senna has got the lead. Senna certainly won it in grand style, so he had to fight all the way. He made a bad mistake at the start, but what he did after that was truly worthy of a new world champion. Ayrton Senna crosses the line and you can see his exultation. This is the opportunity that Senna's looking for and he's going through. Oh, oh my goodness, this is fantastic. They meet. This is what we were fearing might happen during the race. And that means to say that Prost has won the world championship. Senna is trying to go through on the inside, and it's happened immediately. This is amazing. Senna goes off at the first corner, but what has happened to Frost? He has got off too. Well, that is amazing, but I fear absolutely predictable. Yes, and that makes Hatton Senna world champion this year. And Nigel Mansell stops to take his rival, Ayrton Senna, back to the pits. What a lovely scene. I really like that. The wheel stuff, look at this, they're almost touching. Mansell closes, but it's too late, and Ayrton Senna wins at Monaco for the fifth time in six years. An incredible achievement, and Senna goes through into the lead. He's passed Alain Prost, so the McLaren lead across the line, and it is victory for the Brazilian for the 38th time. Up into second place from fourth on the grid goes the incredible Ayrton Senna and just let's enjoy this battle for second. Just cross right up to Senna now as they come to bridge. Nearly home to win the last Grand Prix of 1993. And Ayrton Senna wins in Australia to the delight of his fans.